Hey folks, it's Vagrant. Welcome back to Ghost of Tsushima. In the last video, we moved off to a whole new region and we're steadily waking our way up to the north where we're going to do this mission right here. Ghosts from the past and that's going to unlock the Sakai clan armor, which is really the main reason we're doing it. But we are grabbing some missions along the way just so we can fast travel back later on. I just figure it makes more sense to um, try to pick up the armor as soon as possible. That's about it. You're all caught up if you happen to miss the last episode. <laughs> and somehow watch this episode. I think some people maybe watch an episode but they don't watch the whole episode. So a little recap is helpful. You know, a little, a little recap. A little, a little recap. We're also going to do a new mask. Now, the chances of me replacing my ninja mask, the thief mask, seem quite low, but you never know. We'll see what happens. And uh, along the way, since it is along the way, we're going to go talk to Norio at Kushi Temple. Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> it's so dark all of a sudden. The bamboo forests are uh, a little bit terrifying. Is it up here? I get the feeling this is the right way. Yeah. How cool is this? Fighting! I will protect you, monks. Triple arrow me. Cheeky little blighter, isn't he? Bloody Nora. この有様を見てください。たっとぶべき寺を血で汚すとは許しておけん。連綿と続く知恵が眠っておる地に火をつけようとするなど言語道断です。なぜ襲われたのだ。ここは民の希望の地。大風が猛虎を洗い流すよう皆で住職と共に祈っておりました。しかし今や住職は消え、豊玉随一の宝、寺のご本尊まで奪われる始末。兄が生きていれば、そう
答えてくださるでしょうそうだな励むとしよう Why are you explaining how shrines work at this point in the game? If you tell me the same goddamn thing. What is going on? 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 What is Anyways, all that means is I can't rebalance the sound in post like I usually would. Now, I believe it should be relatively okay anyway, and we should not. No, I'm not talking. I'm not talking to you. I'm not. Go away. I'm going back into the forest. The forest makes me happy. It's a question mark somewhere. Oh, there it is. I'll grab that. Could be the bamboo strike, potentially. Be a good, pretty good place for it. All the individual prefectures have. Oh, it's a fox then. All right, Foxy boy, let's go. Anyways, usually my audio, my game audio, and my voice audio are recorded into separate sound files. Uh, that won't be happening today. And usually, what that does is let me adjust them individually. But I can't have it on like that when I stream and I stream with OBS, so it kind of becomes annoying to have to remember to turn it off and on each time. You know what I mean? So I forgot. <laughs> but hopefully, the sound is okay. One to go. We get a new charm and... And... It should upgrade our existing charm. Unless the charm of silence is the upgraded charm. Which it well could be. But I don't think it is. Remember the other charm was the, the charm of Inari Might. Kakaro. Kakaro. Oh. Kakaro. Kakaro is... I know Kakaro is in um, Zelda. Maybe it's inspired. Same thing. Oh, well, that's the direction we're going. <laughs> you know, towards the fire. Oh, no. Please no archer. Please no archer. I think we're okay. Leave me alone. Just be cool. Like me. Hissing creek. Cr oh, okay. the buttons. <laughs> How do I play this game? Right. I need to kill someone with a heavenly strike, which means I need some This is fine. He's trying to weaken him. I need like a, a normal enemy. I can't, I don't want to do it on a brute. A, a bow dude would be perfect. Where's my bow dude at? There you go. There we go. I think that's the last one as well. <laughs> Oh, eight steel, very nice. Horses aren't liking this, are they? Oops. Cool. I'll go grab that along the way. Okay, let's have a little explore, see what we can find. Yes, katana available for all grade again. It's gonna be cool. Just wondering when we got it off. It felt like we'd got a lot of materials lately. I know we'd had a lot of steel come in. And uh seems like we've hit what we needed. Definitely going to be a top priority, as it always is. And that is the penultimate upgrade. We only have one more to go after this, and we've fully upgraded our katana. Been in there. Been in there. Been in there, question mark? I think so, right? Yeah. I think that might have been my first bow kill from horseback. It was fun. Okay, let's go check out this question mark. Fly, be gone. Sora? Oh, there you are. I can't see a bloody thing around here. Reckon you can cross there? How well is your... S oh, we'll go over here. Looks a little bit shallower.
You can do this, Sora. I believe in you. Okay, no mind. Back in a minute. Are you ready to <laughs> make sure you're ready to teleport? Okay. Okay, good horse. What's going on with this tree? It looks moldy. Wait. <laughs> oh, it's just nonsense. I love it. All the trees around here look like this. I think they're just covered in moss, aren't they? The whole the, the ground has a very mossy, overgrown kind of feel to it. You reckon we make that jump? Let's find out. Nice. Oh my god. I was expecting like a nice wholesome butter. <laughs> I look up and it's this demon thing on fire. That's terrifying. What is this place? Is it nothing? Is it just here? Oh, there's two question marks. Nice. Uh, hmm. Aha! 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 Okay, just need to find a way up there now. There we go. There we go. Lovely stuff. Oh, yeah, cool. Another fox then. This is the one we needed to, um... Well, for whatever the next thing's gonna be. It should upgrade our charm and give us a new charm. Hopefully, anyway. Guess we'll see. Always quite close these days. When the music starts going like that, you know you're very nearby. The diddly 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 diddly. It's precisely what it sounds like. Diddly 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 diddly. Who's a good fox? I want to pet the fox. They keep leaving me. You have earned a charm of silence. Stealth charm. Okay, what's it do? Minor stealth charm. Oh wow. Oh, okay. 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 Reduces enemy detection speed by fifteen percent and increases resolve gains by a minor amount. Honor additional and not wait a minute. Increases resolve gains. Gains. I love increasing resolve gains. Honor additional Inari shrines to permanently increase this charm's effectiveness. <laughs> So, it's like the, uh, that one. I mean, that's still a minor amount, I don't know. Maybe, yeah, I've got no idea. So, it's Charm of Silence. It'd be nice if they were together, wouldn't it? So, Charm of Inari's Might and the Charm of Silence are both the ones that get upgraded as you honour additional shrines. Now, maybe that's not going to come in until we've got all the charms. What are we even wearing right now? Uh, increased supplies, I definitely want to keep that one basically forever. And that one. I don't know about these two anymore, you know. I could reasonably get rid of these and it wouldn't be a big deal. I've got a very simple charm set. I suppose it makes more sense to keep the one until we've maxed out our levels and got all the skills and then we can swap them out if need be. That's probably what we'll do. We are leveling up 30% quicker than we otherwise would, which is pretty... It's a pretty good increase in your speed. Hmm, what is this? Again? Bloody Mongols. I know he moved. He juked me. 
I think we're okay. I really wanted to, uh, I was going to wait, I was hoping he was going to stay there. I was going to climb up on top of the roof and then drop down and assassinate him from above. And it's going to be cool. You see me from over there? There's a dude there. There's a dude. Oh, it's a dog. Sorry. It brings me no joy. Doggo. It really doesn't. Trying to get some of my resolve back. I'm a little low. Well, I've been for a while. But we're climbing. We're climbing. There's a few over there on the left. I know that much. Popped. Oh no! There we go. There's at least one more. There he is. Come on! Thank you. Anyone else? I can see that, buddy. And you, my friend. Kill an enemy. Oh. It really annoys me sometimes. It doesn't pop up in time. Like, it wasn't there, right? It only just popped up in the top left. Maybe I missed it, but that is the first time I saw that. Wait, what's this? Is this not part of it? There we go. <laughs> I'm lucky that this place is big enough to work like this. Oh no! I got you, love. I got you. Yeah, but if this farm set had only been that little area over there, I would have failed that bonus objective just because the game didn't tell me what it was, basically. There should be a better way to force it to pop up. Maybe there is. Maybe if I do the scroll up thing, it'll work better. I'll try that in the future. Ah, weird. There we go. <laughs> we took back the farmstead. Aww. Also cheaper. Ten steel. Oh, you cheeky little blighter. Hello. Bear with me, love. Bear with me. I see something with my name on it. Ah, oh, amazing. <laughs> Two steel. Is that it? Okay. Oh, two more steel. We are going to need... Like, we don't need the steel right now. But, you'd imagine for the final sword upgrade, we're going to need tons of the stuff. So, pretty quickly, it'll happen. Nice. We're going to dodge that question mark for now, because it's kind of a bit more out of the way. I'm set north. <clears throat> the armor of Clan Sakai is calling me. Eh, I say I'm going to dodge it, but it's not that out of the way. Let's go grab it. They never take that long, anyway. And I very much doubt it's another bandit camp or anything, or a uh, Mongol camp, so. Trust me here, Sora. Good job. What have we got here? Fox then, probably? No, oh, it's a haiku spot. Huh? 
to you. The reason. Reflect on survival. Okay. Twisted and flailing. Thriving in the dark. That's very suitable for what we've been doing at the moment. Giving life to all. I think we thrive in the dark. A wandering mind searches. Yeah, it's not bad. Idle blades grow ever dull. Yeah, I like that one. It's about our survival and how we were turning to the darkness. And though we turn to this darkness, we do not find the answers we seek. Uh, oh, oh, you're a cheeky one. Oh, I don't know. I like the red on that, but I like the gold on that. I really do like the one I've got, though. <laughs> I'm kind of going for a slightly evil kind of look on my guy, you know? Right, with that done. Back to the north we go. We're finally under a kilometre away as well. It's been a bit of a trek, this one. We've come across basically the entire map, so... Uh, somebody did tell me I was a little apprehensive that it was taking us so long to play this game. <laughs> but I have been informed that the second and third map are, you know, it's substantially less stuff in them, basically. So it should definitely not take nearly as long. Hmm. I guess I'm going to have to go around. But still, enjoying the game. Plenty of time left to go. Probably 20 episodes or something like that, if I had to guess. We're definitely doing one of the slower playthroughs out there. <laughs> oh, we do have another game on the way. Those are curious. Uh, Muscle Hunter, so Muscle Hunter's not that far from being done, oddly enough. There's definitely lots of monsters still to hunt, but like I don't hunt them all the time, basically. You know, it's not like every stream I'm now hunting a new monster. Ooh. Where are you? You're down there. Oh, you're in a really awkward position. There's a banner here. Alright, down we go. Anyways, so, like, usually every stream led to one or two videos, and now it's like every two streams leads to a video, maybe, at a push. So, things are a little bit different. So, it means I need another playthrough, and then Monster Hunter will just pop back in whenever I take on a new monster, basically. Okay. Oh, hey. Huh? Jewel under falling water. All right. I can't lose him. He's got a stupid hat on. more than I expect and it's messing me up. Bloody hell! I'm getting smashed here. That's a hell of a follow-up. My god I might actually lose my first duel. Ah! Woo! 
boy. Ooh, I was close. I got used to it by the end, but my god. That was, uh... <laughs> oh. Yeah. <laughs> that, was, that was hard work. Hey, what do I get for this? What's the point in this? Alright. Should be straw hat. I know they're just doing it for money, but come on, be cool. Why does he have a question mark? Oh, whatever. Right, I need to find a way back up. Um, can I get back up the way I came? Probably. It's a hell of a place for a jewel. That was tough, though. He hits very hard. And there's at one point where I got hit like four times in a row. And for some reason, I kept healing rather than trying to block and actually get out of the situation. I just tapped healing. I burnt through all of my resolve. It's probably the main reason we had a problem, so. But hey, I didn't die. I still haven't died in a while. I'm still holding out hope that I can do the rest of the game without dying. Come on, Sora. Fine. Bet you won't teleport over. Oh, that's it. <laughs> now you don't have a bloody problem, do you? Do Here, I think I hear a fox. I could have sworn there was another question mark, like, right in front of me. Am I crazy? Maybe. It certainly seems that way. <laughs> I've been imagining question marks. I don't think it was this one. Oh, okay. Let's do him. Oh, double fainted. Oh, triple. Cheeky little player. Not enough, is it, though, boys? Just not enough. Right, so again, I have this problem. What is? There we go. Destroy the cache, eliminate the general, recover banners, kill an enemy. So all I have to do is actually kill an enemy with kunai. It's fine. It's funny how just a simple thing like, hey, I'm just gonna head to the north and do this mission. <laughs> like we get stopped by like 50 different things along the way. All right, let's go in. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wait, what are you doing? Alright. Oh. Where are all the guys? Where's the actual camp? Is it over here mainly? Yeah. That's what's been throwing me. I need to gather some enemies together if I'm going to do this. Ah, doggo! 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 Ah! See, that's the problem. I only... I need, I need more kunais. I need to run around until I find some kunais now. <laughs> uh, right. Bear with me, lads. Doggo! I feel so mean. Ah! Not that I should, because the dog's kicking my ass in a way. Kunai, 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 kunai. Somewhere kunai. Kunai! Lovely. Hi, boys. God oh, damn it, they didn't die again. Need more kunais. <laughs> kunais, there we go. This time. There we go. This is, um... Look how many enemies there are over there. What the hell? <laughs> so many.
many of them! I mean, that was pretty cool. <laughs> I think we can see that was pretty bloody cool. Ah. Oh god. Fire sword. Fire sword. Enough with the bloody fire swords! <sighs> I killed six people then with two smoke bombs. Smoke bombs are insane. Smoke bombs are better than kudai's. I killed six people because because we got the uh, you know the better chain assassination ability. Six of them went down to smoke bombs. That was insane. I've never. I don't think I've ever dealt with that many enemies in one location. All 1v1? That many Mongols? That's nuts. Absolutely nuts. Two to go. I'm gonna do some exploring now. It's a pretty huge area, this. Quite hard to explore. Bloody Nora. I need a minute from that one. That was insane. <sighs> okay. Hey, we won. Right, that's all that matters. But yeah, the chain assassination, three chain assassinations is so good. Oh, I forgot. Oh, okay. I'm still vibrating, though. Must be something else in here. Probably an artifact. Based on past experience. But, I mean, it's a Greek vase. During the summer of 1242, the Mongol defeat of the Latin Empire caused a major power shift in the Asian Aegean world. An invading force led by Kadan, son of the second great Khan, Ogadai, swept southward after devastating Bulgaria and Serbia. Though repelled during an initial encounter in Thrace, subsequent relations between the Mongol Khans and the Latin Emperor Baldwin II suggest he was at some point captured and forced to submit and pay tribute to the Mongol armies. This is likely how the Vars ended up in Mongol hands. I don't know why I said vase. I say Vars. <laughs> I'm a Vars kind of boy, you know? What can I say? Ammo full, apparently. Okay. I feel like there's no way I'm ever going to explore every building in this place. But we'll do our best. Oh. Vibrating's kicked off again. It's in here. There it is. Oh, we've got some records as well. Very cool. Let's wait for that. Conversations with Khan 6. These are my favourite records. Kotona appears to have put the events of Castle Kaneda and the liberation of Lord Shimura behind him, partly because he holds Castle Shimura, which is strategically more important, to maintain control of the island. It is also shields his forces in the north, which carry out orders so secret that I might not have been able to discover... I might not that I have not been able to discover what they might be, and I think it gives Kotun pleasure to defile the seat of the Shimura clan's power. In any event, Kotun seems confident that his enemies will exhaust themselves fighting amongst each other and the Mongols. All he needs to do is suck up food, supplies and munitions, and depart from the mainland when the time is right. 
I don't know, man. The longer he takes, surely word has got to the mainland in some description about what's going on here, right? The longer he hangs around here, the more that the mainland's going to be able to prepare. Now, I know his plan is to kind of turn the Tsushimans, I don't know what else you'd call them, against the Japanese, essentially, and, like, have them fight with him for the mainland, but I'm not convinced that's happening, so. There's a traitor here and there, but we've not heard much of them. Uh, set this on fire? Set it on fire. It's totally unnecessary, but I think it looks cooler. <laughs> Alright, there we go. Done. Huh? Alright. Not done. Defeat the Mongols? <laughs> Right, remind me, I need to put a point, just for this purpose, in the... this. I don't have a point, do I? Oh, that's pretty cool. I want that. Just, just more distant enemies. Just so I can find them during times like this, because I've got no idea where these Mongols are. Mongols! Mongols. Check the towers for archers. If I was a Mongol, they're probably back on the other side, aren't they? I came over here pretty quickly. I see one right there, actually. We done? <laughs> no. There's probably a few over here, actually. Sheep, sheep, sheep. Hi boys. Can't block the fire attack. <laughs> he can't block that, so. There we go. Hey, look at them all fishing. Got traders in and everything. Lovely. I think we got two technique points here. It's like everything we're liberating and stuff, actually, we're seeing a difference, you know, we're seeing a, a natural change in the towns. This didn't happen that much with um, the lower prefecture. Come on, up you pop. <laughs> I know, you're tired, you deserve a nap. I'm glad that, I'm glad that they show that, that he is every now and again having a, you know, he's sleeping and he's recuperating somewhat. You don't have anything, do you? Not even loading. Do you get any bouquets? No. But you didn't help. Yeah. Very cool. We're getting loads of stuff here. Right. I look how much of this map we've cleared already. It doesn't look like that much necessarily, but it is. It genuinely is. Compared to the rate we were cleaning the last one, I think because it's smaller and they still want you to have to like take out lots of Mongols, they cramped quite a lot of camps in quite a smaller space. And that means when you kill the Mongols and clear those camps out, you're going to fill out more of the island because it's smaller in the first place. Remind of the plan, we want to go get the armor, which we'll probably end up doing next video. I mean, we'll start it today, but we'll finish it next video. But then, we're going to head back to the south and we're going to go clear those farmsteads out as well. 
I think so, I know. We're definitely going back to do it at some point, but... Hmm. Well, this is beautiful. You know what? Thanks, Sora. <laughs> this is beautiful. It makes sense. This is where we live, you know? This would be... Bah. Oh, no, dogs. So many dogs! So many dogs! Ah! I'm so sorry! Your masters are dead, why are you still attacking me? I'm so sorry! Yeah, yeah, I heard you. There's looting to do, love. There's looting to do. Okay, let's get you out of here. Can't have someone captured and mongolized so close to my own hometown. This is why these are really helpful though, because they always give you a little something for the uh the map, basically. Look, if I do this, shoop. So now we know there's a fort there. We can go clear that out and clear out the whole area. Handy, handy. <laughs> I was gonna make a joke there. Uh, horse. A horse, of course. I hear a fox. I'm pretty sure I hear a fox. Could just be a screaming deer. That's a deer I'll want to do. But who knows. This is our home village! Oh me! Oh my! That's beautiful as well. I love it. I hope everyone's happy and wholesome. I've come to steal my linens. Well, it's a bit quiet, isn't it? Hmm. Don't like that. Where's everyone gone? Okay. No sign of anybody, though, buddy. What's going on? I see it. I'm vibrating. There's a question mark there. I think it might be a uh, bamboo strike. <clears throat> the armor's gone. Isn't it? Wasn't it hung up there? Oh no. I like you, Rico. Seems lovely. Ghosts from the past. Why do I suspect it's not going to be quite as easy as... Oh, we hit it over here. Oh, we'll go wear it. Okay, job done. <laughs> I guess we'll see. さあ、こちらへ。体が重い。大地にとってこさせましょう。墓地にいるはずです。そこで何を土を鳴らし、毒草の世話をさせています。
猛虎に捕らえられていたがお救いいたしたどなたか他に手を貸す者はおるぞ政子殿だまあ幼き頃から王のこと稽古していましたからね<笑>いつか司祭を聞かせてくれ政子様だけですか他には石川先生ももう何年も無沙汰しております相変わらず尊大なお振る舞いなのです<笑>ああいまだになだが弓の腕はでっかくだご本人もいろんないかと Go away, fly. Tachi. That's name Taichi. Taichi. Sakai Sama. Omodori de. Isogi Nano. Taichi. Yuri no Sewa o Stekrete or Soda. Sewa Sareter no Cochira no Hotus. Taichi. Yoro Yomo Tech Tokre. Tanum. Orewa Hakani. Oh, Papa. There's a lot of uh, guilt assigned here. Remember, <clears throat> um, Jim watched his father die, and you know, basically did nothing to help him at the time. He was only a kid. It's very understandable, but you still carry guilt. Okay, I think that's our uh, thumbnail. <laughs> Amazing. Reflect on legacy, Papa. I mourn my father. No, I leaves shade my father. I prefer that one. Life for my father. I leaves shade my father. I, I prefer thinking of him as protected and happy, and he's looking over Tsushima rather than, you know, he's dead, basically. Leaves shade my father. His grave close, his soul distant. I thought oh, they're all a little bit too literal. Those ones going over here. Now I am alone. All things pass away. This old tree lives on. There we go. It's like that. You know, his soul's gone, his, his body's here, but the tree kind of symbolizes the preservation of the soul and the hardness and that it can't be destroyed by, you know, mortal wounds. And despite everything, the old oak lives on. And that's my father, the big old tree. Or something. <clears throat> Dad, if you're watching this, you're not a big tree. I'm sorry. <laughs> also, Dad, why are you watching this, you weirdo? Shoot.
It's ready to let go of the guilt. Become the samurai he was always meant to be. The armor looks stupid. <laughs> I don't know what to add to that. The armor looks stupid. I think it needs upgrading though, and that's why. Yeah. Oh, that's straw house. Oh, nice. While wearing this armor, standoff streak increases by one, so we can kill four enemies in a row. Oh, that's pretty sweet. Here we go. No need to be scared. けがはないか。死まぬためよ。またやりかな面倒なことに。やりかの判断は二昔も前。あやつらはもうこの手下だ。そうでしょうとも。あのような戦いぶり。まことを恐ろしい。休ませてください。湖の綺麗迷路。え
Every other aspect of it is uh, it's pretty cool, actually. So we should be able to get four of them here. If there is, if the reason is, yeah, there is cool. Oh, I'm an idiot! I'm an idiot! I got beaten by the the bait. Ah, oh, can chain it again. God, Papa would not approve of what I just did. <laughs> I am become death. Destroyer of worlds. I really like this bow. Longbow is really growing on me. What am I doing? Weeds. There you go. My first ever opportunity to do a more than three standoff streak, and I ruin it on the first guy. Yikes. Scuzzy, <sighs> miscuzzy. What's wrong, Eureka? もう良いだろう。吹き筒と針が揃った。あとは毒だけだ。では参りましょう。こちらへ。どうぞ。薬草を育てるために作った小さな野営があります。そして毒草も獅子をも殺す強さです。猛攻を殺せる強さにしてく
いろんな薬草を探す時だけですでは薬草を集めましょう休んでおれ俺が積もう I'll do all the work don't you worry about it love 種は毒です食べないで子供扱いは<laughs> I was just about to chow down on the flowers ハハウェアに花を送られましたね。母上は綺麗に飾ってくださったな。それで十分。こちらへお持ちください。待たせたな。いいえ。まず種を抜き取り、身を砕き、森状にしたら針を浸します。効き目は強いのか。納得いただけ
We must return. Right, we should do the upgrades first. Sakai-sama. You're welcome, Shino. Who are you? Are you the armor? What are you? Are you the bow? You're the armor. Sweet. Right, so Sakai clan armor, here we go. So by default, it's got a moderate increase to melee damage and a moderate increase to health, which is pretty great. And increases standoff streak by one, and winning a standoff has a 10% chance to terrify nearby enemies, which isn't very high, it must be said. 10%. Okay, that one bulks it up a, quite a lot. Uh, that just major increase in melee damage. It's pretty great. Massive increase to health. Oh my god, I love the helmet actually. I'm never going to wear it, but I do like it. Grab that. And then standoff streak by two and winning a standoff 25% chance. Let's grab it. Mate. Why is it always that? This confuses me every single time. Every single level changes how the armor looks, except the last one. This seems like the opposite of how it should be to me. <laughs> Am I going to upgrade this? No. I mean, I've got to say, this this one makes... The Sakai clan armor makes the samurai clan armor seem pretty pointless. Look at me! I'm a unit! I'm still not a helmet guy, though. I just, I'm just not. I just, I just don't... I, it's a really cool helmet. It really is. Look at it. It's really cool. But it's not for me. You know what? I don't hate the mask. The half mask. But still, no. <laughs> like, I just... I like what I like. Although I will say, this is a combo. Doesn't really make sense, does it? It looks a bit strange. The mask and the, the headband and this armour. Right, I want to find a merchant. Is there a merchant here? Yeah, somewhere. And he's got two new vanity gears, which I'm assuming is... The, uh... For this armor. I actually quite like the default color scheme, though. There we go. So we've got Blood of the Clan. Very red. Light of Victory. Very white. And Ancestral Force. Don't like any of them. <laughs> I like this one more. I like the default more than any of those. I think it's really useful. It is. It's, it's a great armor. Oh, huge increase to health. Stuff like that. I mean, look at my health bar. It's nuts. And... That's great and everything, it really is. However, <laughs> however, I'm just going to use the Traveler's stuff. Until the game is hard enough that I think I need to swap. I've always preferred... I've never really been big on bulky armors. Yeah, I'll do that again. <laughs> I've never really been big on bulky armors. I like the nimble sort of look, you know? If we get into like a really tough situation, let's say we're going on like a big fort attack or something like that, we will swap our entire gear set and we'll swap and we'll wear the helmet and we'll wear all the armor and absolutely everything. 90% of the time we're probably wearing this armor, but there will be situations in which we swap. I promise you that much. Oh, we can upgrade our katana as well. I forgot. Amazing. It does look really cool though. Nice. Any visual change? <laughs> I like the visual changes more than anything. It's a slight change, I think. Yeah, the uh, the engraving, the line down the middle doubles up. It's just a small damage increase. Right, we need 17 more pieces of... Oh my god, look at the steel requirement. Jesus! We are not getting that one for a long, long time. 80 steel. That's absolute insanity. Okay, I guess we're probably... Honestly, I would be surprised if we upgrade this again before we're finished with this whole area. We have many, many, many missions to do over here. Many, 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 many missions. Now that I've got my armor, I guess we can kind of just start working our way from the south up. I suppose. Yeah? Yeah, oh, uh, is there a trapper here? 
I want to go talk to the trapper as well. I'm wondering if I can maybe upgrade my dart carrying capacity. You're welcome, Sinnoh. You're the armorsmith. Oh, dude. Where's the trapper? Thanks. There's merchant. There's the bowsmith. The bower. There's the trapper at. Maybe we should just go somewhere smaller. <laughs> like somewhere where it's easier to find them. We'll see if I can increase the carrying capacity for our blowgun darts. I just think... I, like, it sounds really cool. You know, stand off, yeah, kill five people right away, but... It hasn't been that helpful, I wouldn't say. Like, it's five people. It doesn't feel like a huge amount of people, you know? Where's the bloody trapper at? Where's the trapper, the only one I can't see? Oh, he's over there. There we go. Poison dart. Boop. We need to start hunting again. Like, wild animals, because we actually need predator hides. Predator hides pretty badly. I want to upgrade my smoke bomb capacity as well. <laughs> well do. With so many missions. So many missions. Okay, so we're gonna start off I guess we'll start off right here, because we're here. And we'll just we'll just start working our way through. Simple as that. We'll do that in the next video. Thank you so much for joining me, ladies and gentlemen. I will see you lovely folks then. Cheers, most of us always. Bye-bye.